Nothing's entirely wrong Kick the hole in the game Before multiple views By time be gone Gotta be strong When you're popping The paparazzi form Sliders singing In your local precinct Like a You know what it is man Salute to the subscribers That notification gang Etc etc Don't let none of that Get too far ahead of you You know who I be Follow me on IG Vada underscore fly Tell your mama I said hi Shout out to my guy Showtime SP Also my network partners And my dog Scrap uh, Speaking of Scrap It's a documentary That we did For Drop Your Location Trenches I will be dropping it today Gully gutter vibe We're in like a Kind of like a warehouse Shackle yeah. house Trap house Yeah Scene from powerhouse it's Definitely you know a what I'm tricky saying? feel You know what I'm saying I feel like I gotta keep my eyes open It's a cat all the way At the top Like all the way At the top up there yeah, he got the drop on That's Sting. That is Sting occupying. Where is he anyway? Way high up above the fans, almost like. If he needed, if, if we was doing anything wrong, he had to drop. Right, right, right in the sniper's view. Uh, we got a couple more battles. You know what I'm saying? You can go ahead and check that out. It's got when Geechee texted me to set up a battle with Bill. All of the winners, the losers, me asking about the judges, all the interviews and behind the scenes content. Check that out. You know what I'm saying? That really be good content that we be doing after the events that we try to put on and give you a in the building vibe and experience and sh like that. You know what I'm saying? So if you got some time, I will be dropping that joint later today. So shout out to y'all. Um, I've been seeing everything that's been going on online. I'm talking back and forth. You know what I'm saying? With uh, Tay Rock, Easy the Black Captain. I must say, I must say that. A lot of this got kicked off when Tay Rock did overtime interview up there at Fox with us. He had expressed how he felt about Easy the Black Captain, whether it be from him leaving gun titles, wanting to battle. And it, to me, it was battle rap at the time. You know what I'm saying? It was battle rap. He can't F with me on no level. I'm better than him. You know, he's been here since 2000, whatever. I've been here. It was all really, really, really good just battle rap talk. But my question there when we was interviewing was how would this battle ever happen? You know? I'm, I'd be doing favors. Mm -hmm. That's just how I feel. Mm -hmm. like, to battle Big K? Any of them. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. And why like, is that? Uh, just because I'm the one that's out here really running around, putting in work. They just making it seem like they is. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I haven't seen everybody that they already battled. Yeah. Like they just getting that. Mm -hmm. Just they could have been seen me. Yeah. <laughs> like, Who's they? That's both of them, or is just both of them? I'm just making sure, man. Both well, you know, you know. They. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> the names <laughs> we speaking <laughs> upon. No problem. <laughs> the names we speaking upon. Both of them both niggas was in you all real. Both well. of them niggas been around ten years, just like me. Both of them niggas. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Been Who's been around ten years, years though? Said, both of them. Both them niggas been around ten years. Respect. Both of them niggas been around just as long as me. Right. Why am I at the top of the mountain waiting on these niggas? Or why do I have to come down from the top of the mountain to come meet these niggas halfway? This is a conversation. You know what I'm saying? Hear you know, it. you know. That's, that, that's, the funny, that's the funny thing. You like, know, you know that's the saying? talk. Like, I we know love you, it though. We know you known to not duck any smoke. So, mm -hmm. so how can we, how can we basically get the stick to the stone to get this fire actually started? Because I want to see this. Do can do you see this happening within the next year? Or is this something where it's just all policy talk? Is this gonna be like a Lux and Daylight type thing? Cause we know nah, either like, one of those two is, is nah, monumental for that. Yeah, about to say if I get in if if we gonna make something happen, we're gonna make something happen, we ain't gonna drag out years. Like that's mm -hmm. crazy. Lux and light should have been happening. Like, yeah. So uh, how about to say, so let's do this, right? So okay. We know you uh it was in, you, you're in gun titles, you lead gun titles, you know what I'm saying? You surf and everyone else in gun titles respectfully. Mm -hmm. right, you right. and Easy was in gun titles. I mean, obviously, Easy dropped his resignation paperwork. It's 14 days, whatever he dropped, he got the fuck right, out right. of the group, right? Mm -hmm. So, how'd you feel about that? Let's talk about that part. How'd you feel Shit, about that? Man, when that I didn't know how I feel about it. I thought mm -hmm. it was whack. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. So, did that, you get any word before Twitter got nah, the nah, statement? Nah, no, no, no. He didn't hit me, let me know. No, I mean, that's just how he wanted to move. I mean, I respect that. Because at the end of the day, you let niggas know exactly how you are. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Don't so draw no paperwork and leave me. That was just fucking with you. Know, <laughs> at least uh, let me know. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, so how did it go from, and this is, a, you know, these are questions that people really be wanting to know. How did it go from, you know, obviously y'all, he goes his way, you go your way, to people wanting to see y'all actually battle. You know what I'm saying? Like, how did, when, when, what, what made it to where this is a battle that's damn near one of the battles if that battle was booked this year, wherever it's, this is gonna sell out, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Regardless of where mm -hmm. it's gonna be, how did it become y'all to like people want to see y'all battle? Now? That's just something he always wanted to do. Mm. 
Yeah. Well, I agree. Is that I something just, you think or no? No, I just feel like, mm. I just feel that just the energy. Like, you get what I'm saying? Just the, ever since he joined Gun Titles. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Like, you know, him getting the shine that he's getting. Mm. And it's just like, don't get too big for your for yourself. Mm -hmm. Like, you get what I'm saying? In my, in my mind, Mm -hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? We ain't never had this talk to where it's like, yo, do you think you can fuck with me? Because mm -hmm. <laughs> you can't. We ain't yeah. never had that combo, but in my mind, it's like, nigga, like, all right, you mm -hmm. think you can fuck with me. Oh, so you say you can't fuck with me, I mean, nigga. I'm just asking well, a question, you know, nigga. I, 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 I was just about to ask that. Could you fuck like, with me? Yeah. In what aspect <laughs> of, of battling? It's, in views? <laughs> in, in battles? In resume? In what? <laughs> in what? I mean,. In what? what? No, I mean, in like, what? I got the same amount of views versus Hitman that he got. No, oh, yeah, I mean, your battle, your hit, you, nobody liked your battle versus Hitman. Before, and it was years before too. Nah, so I'm, I'm like, like right, 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 right. Smoking <laughs> the blueprint, I mean. Mm. So how do you feel when? When people, you know what I'm saying, quantifiably ask you these type of questions. Now, I mean, obviously we have the access for Mali, mm -hmm. but when people think nah, that I, MCs are on your level, or you know, what I'm saying, how do you like? Does it feel disrespectful? No, nah, I, don't, just I mean, I really thing? feel like they just they haven't, they don't know much about what I get into, or mm -hmm. and they ain't been watching me as long. Mm -hmm. Niggas couldn't been watching me as long as I've been watching me asking me that. Right, right. right <laughs> like you know what I'm saying, like not since the beginning, mm -hmm. especially if you were a diehard fan. Like, mm -hmm. And the last thing I wanted to ask about it, uh, you know, I know he's on Chrome 23. I know you're doing your thing on URL. If this was to even come about, like, does he have to go to URL? Do you have to go to Chrome? Is there a middle ground? Like, how does this even happen? I don't know what I'm saying. You are on URL. Easy's on the trenches. Obviously, he left unceremoniously, kicked up all of this dust, caused this confusion, and y'all just wasn't seeing it eye to eye. Obviously, Easy used to be a member of Gun Titles. He left Gun Titles. Pretty much no call, no show and went to do his own thing. He builds his own league, The Trenches. I'm gonna be honest with you, I've said it in another blog. The Trenches has had events, events, over the year, that have been comparable to some of the other big leagues. I'm not saying they're on, on, on top, but they've consistently had events this year that make you pull out your credit card and purchase them. That is the key thing in this. So, uh, Rock is not gonna battle over there. Easy's not gonna battle over there. Rock is adamantly stating that he ain't doing no favors for him, because uh, I ain't gonna lie. A lot of Easy's year, a lot of the battles, a lot of the situations that he have, have been hand-picked from the opponent to where it's gonna happen, what city it's gonna be in, what, 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 what fucking YouTube channel this shit is gonna drop on. Like, he just literally has controlled the whole situation in a lot of these battles that he's had. Rock is letting him know up front, you ain't controlling nothing. If you want to battle me, you got to come over here. Smack is letting him know that Rock calls the shots and makes the shots, whatever the case may be. Kind of like cracking the door for a potential easy going back to URL to potentially battle him. Do I think that's going to eventually happen? No, because the way things have looked, easy likes to control the situation, you know what I'm saying, the battle and all this other shit. And I just don't see them battling. You know what I'm saying? I didn't see them battling when we interviewed, and I definitely don't see them battling now. Um, I definitely don't see him battling now because of all of the extra shit that's going on now. Uh, you know, John John Don drops audio of Easy, makes him look out of pocket. He looks out of pocket. This shit looks crazy. I already expressed this more than once. This whole situation, that shit looks crazy and it's nasty work. You know what I'm saying? So Rock is, you know, Rock is John John's man. Other people that rock with John John Don or that just feel like he won. Like it is what it is. You don't even have to feel any other way. Like you can feel like he won a battle. You know what I'm saying? John John Don did his motherfucking thing and to many won. You see what I'm saying? So his friends are gonna over embellish it. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna dance in the end zone. That's just the way the shit goes. But the thing is, easy wants to, to be the algorithm. When you choose to be the algorithm, you have to algorithm whether it's positive, negative, or indifferent. You know what I'm saying? So this is the shit that I be talking about. I never subscribed or dug any of this shit. I wasn't a fan of when the shit was happening on Easy Side, and I wasn't a fan when the shit was happening with Verb in them. That's why I was so adamant about Verb. Yo, you, you gotta talk about this shit. Who the fuck is with this audio? Audio? I hated it. When niggas try to include me in it, I'm like, bro, like I don't get down like this. This shit is crazy. I work on all levels, which is why I was adamant about. It. If it's me, put it out today. Put it out today because I know I just don't operate like that. Like I don't be running around recording niggas and shit. That shit is whack. Like it's whack on all levels. Plus, niggas should be knowing who they talk to. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't even know how easy them even got to this point. You know what I'm saying? Well, you don't even know who the fuck you talk to, and you talk to this nigga and talk to that. That shit is crazy. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I didn't have. No contact with any of these guys were easy. I hadn't spoke to him in months. 
I hadn't spoke to him since he changed his number way, way months ago when all of the first shit happened or whatever the case may be, or allegedly or whatever the case may be. When the first incident happened, I hadn't spoke to him in months. So I had literally spoke to him like two days before the trenches event and he wanted me to do the face off. I said I couldn't do it because of my daughter's birthday and I had television. But then we spoke and he wanted me to do the commentary. I said, yo, it's cool. Bill wants me to come through anyway. The only reason why I even did commentary was because Bill Collector was adamant about me wanting me and SP to be there. He even was willing to pay for our travel. And I told him, nah, I was like, bro, I ain't gonna take that money. You know what I'm this is just me keeping it honest with you today. So I found a way to be involved with the event so I could see my man get his bars off and to st and still be a part of it and help with the flow of the event. Now, it's not going to be what you got on Max Out. You know what I'm saying? I read LTBR. Salute to LTBR. I love what they do. You know what I'm saying? Great analytical perspective of the culture. They break down shit. And I'm going to get to why Tay Rock and uh, Easy will never battle. You know, I don't even think it's ever going to happen. But they do great you know, breakdown of the culture. And I seen that they was a little critical of the commentary. And I understood why. Because I said, yo, when you got 24 hours notice to do a whole event, you're coming from another state, you're doing it for the love, you know what I'm saying? You're not even staying there, you're flying in, you're flying out. It's a lot of moving pieces. So what we was really trying to do was be as entertaining and keep the event flowing as much as possible. And I got a lot, a lot of great feedback, but my partners that do the same thing that I do have to understand that uh, when you're in that venue, because we was there, you know what I'm saying? It's a table like this. It's like 100 people standing in front of you. Your bags is there, avocados, mics, and equipment. All of this shit is in the middle of a crowd. So you can't even go up to the battle to listen to it because all of this equipment, people's shit is back there. So we had to literally sit at this table and try to hear and see the battle. And we did the best of our ability. It was what it was. But, <clears throat> you know, I'm just letting you guys know. So, um, and this is all, you'll see it all in the documentary later. Go watch the documentary later. You'll see it. Please, please, please do. So, you got Rocky Easy now. Uh, they got crews that's involved. They got these this crew that's involved, you know what I'm saying? Easy got the people that he rolled with that's dedicated and loyal to him. Rock got the people that he rolled with that's gonna rock with him, you know what I'm saying? And where you get that from? Your mama. Fuck you. Fuck you. Come on outside, man. Stop playing. <laughs> Gotta get dressed. His people was actually in the venue. I was like, oh shit. Shout out to Battle Academy and everything they got going. I seen they was in the damn venue. And I'm like, these niggas though obviously don't openly don't get along. And they literally are <laughs> in the venue. They just went well, on oh, my man Luke jumped in my interview. That's my man though, you know what I'm saying? I rock with dude. I rock with everybody that they got going on. See, for me, it's kind of funny because I thought, you know what I'm saying? I'm cool with both sides. I don't really got no issues with none of them niggas, you know what I'm saying? So I don't be liking to see the direction that a lot of this shit is going. And Quest McCody has said it earlier, you know what I'm saying? I want to pull up Quest's tweet real quick. He has said something that 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 made a lot of sense to me, you know what I'm saying? And I, and I had retweeted it and told him thank you. He said, um, he said, and I quote, any blogger helping publicize and promoting real life drama between battlers needs a serious reality check. It's all fun and games till something happens. And I said, Quest, thank you, somebody gets it. Now, do I feel like a nigga going to die? No, I don't feel like that, you know what I'm saying? I don't feel like niggas going to get killed. Ain't nobody getting killed, smack. Ain't nobody getting killed, smack. But I do feel like it's a lot of negativity and shit being promoted, you know what I'm saying? Like. Because these guys, a lot of the folks that be promoting this shit and wanting people to beef and fight, they don't be there. You know what I'm saying? Their lives is not at risk. You know what I'm saying? It's not a fight that's going to happen in front of you because you're not there. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could start shit from Phoenix or from fucking uh, Florida or some shit and knowing that niggas is going to be in the city and I'm just blogging on it and egging people on and putting these titles out and dramatizing shit. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of ways to make money off battle rap other than wanting niggas to beef, you know what I'm saying? Like, like battlers are battlers. They gonna do their thing, they gonna promote their shit the way they gonna promote it, but when people are online, you know, Easy's telling them you could SMD, you could SMD, and Rock is SMD and SMD, and it's just like this shit is it's getting too, 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 too much. Because I'm telling you, it don't even be the artist. The artist could work their shit out, you know what I'm saying? Like, they've done it before, they'll do it some more. It be the people around them that's gonna crash out, you know what I'm saying? And these venues do not be the safest environments, you know what I'm saying? They'll have one nigga at the door, cool. He's checking people, cool, cool, cool. But once you go outside that door, <sighs> you don't know what's going on. You don't know what's on the other side of that door. And I'm just saying that I don't think that they can battle, at least anytime soon, they cannot battle because where's it gonna be? You know what I'm saying? What kind of setting do you feel like is safe for both of these guys and their crews to be at the same place after everything that was said, everything that's being done, you know what I'm saying? I'm seeing tweets from this person, tweets from that person, videos from this person, and they just going back and forth in on each other. 
And I just feel like there's so much money that could be made in battle rap. And I don't got no dog in the fight because I done had Rock at, at Fox and I done had Easy there. You know what I'm saying? And I would, if I had to bring either one, I'd bring them both back again because I feel like they're phenomenal MCs that are great at what they do. You know what I'm saying? But when you mix, it, see, it becomes a bad mixture. When you mix ego from both sides, pride from both sides, you know what I'm saying? Respect from both sides, uh, shit talk from both sides, and crews. Once you mix all five of those in a pot, this one's talking shit to this one's crew, that one's talking shit to that one's crew. I just don't see it happening anytime soon, you know what I'm saying? Because uh, what if I, cause there, it's been a lot, and I ain't really like here to be posting like a bunch of the tweets and shit because I'm not, I don't want to promote it, you know what I'm saying? But what I, what I will say is both of y'all niggas is out of pocket, you know what I'm saying? And this is coming from a neutral party. Yes, I blog. Yes, I do media. Yes, I, I'm who I am. But today is just me being somebody that likes both of y'all talent and would love to see. Would I love to see a battle between y'all? Of course I would. But do I think it can happen? I don't think it can happen right now. I don't. Because both are very prideful and both got big egos. Rock feel like I've been here for 10 years doing this shit. He's rightfully so. That's why I asked him when I asked him. I'm like, yo, you, you, you hear this shit? Easy been here for two. He been here for 10. That's why Rock feels the way he feels. But Easy shot up so meteorically that it makes it seem like, you know what I'm saying, I'm either above you or we equal or below. What I don't fucking know and don't care. As far as with the whole John John battle shit, it was a great battle. You could pick John John 2 1, you could pick Easy 2 1. I really don't give a fuck. I've never seen so many grown men online arguing about the next person's opinion. However you feel is how you feel, it's not wrong. It's a fucking debatable. At the end of the day, there's, I don't know how they're going to be able to judge that or give that money out. That's why I vehemently expressed in the beginning that I didn't want any parts of it. Because I was like, yo, this is going to be a fucking mess. And now it is becoming a mess. Uh, as far as like for the battlers and for the leagues and shit like that, it's just another day in the office. It's straight politics. It's straight business. But I don't think, I, I don't foresee that battle happening anytime soon. Because it's too much emotion. They talk about each other's girl. It's, their wife, their kids, and this, and this, and that. It's just, it's beyond repair, you know what I'm saying? And they're in Philadelphia, you know what I'm saying? But, I must say this, between them two brothers, man, I hope they can find some kind of road where, you know what I'm saying, they can, they can move on about their careers, because this shit right here ain't gonna fly. It is not going to fly. Any way you try to bring them two together within the next five, six, seven months, it's gonna be an issue, you know? And why would Easy go back to battle on URL after he publicly tore down the pro platform, publicly left, publicly shamed him, talked shit about him, did all of this shit. Why would he go back over there and think he gonna get a fair run in there, in that joint? When he just spent the whole year controlling where he wanted to battle, where the battles was gonna be released, what color a motherfucker should wear, the nigga damn near controlled everything. You know what I mean? So he's not gonna, he's not gonna fucking, um, he's not gonna, he's not gonna go back over there where he's not controlling anything. And then Rocky's looking at it like nigga. I ain't going like that. I'm not doing nothing for you. And I feel like Tay Rock is one of the best battle rappers to ever do this shit. He's one of my personal friends. Like, I fuck with Rock, you know what I'm saying? I know Rock. I, uh, I'm cool with his girl, Caution, you know what I'm saying? They're they my people. So I got love for what they do in battle rap and with shit like that. And you know what I'm saying? I rock with Easy too. I ain't got no issue with him. You know what I'm saying? I, as, as I mentioned earlier, I felt like that whole shit with this whole audio and everything else, how this whole shit is playing out is out of pocket. But as my man, I can tell you that. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you always feel like I ain't done something solid, you'll let me know. You know what I'm saying? We've, we've, we've had conversations in the past, but at the same time, because he told me when he first booked me to, <laughs> to do the fucking pay-per-view, he was like, yo, man, there's a couple people. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, nigga, you know what you book? Yes, sir! This nigga's spitting. Damn, nigga. Nigga, you know what you book, nigga. I'm the show, nigga. And tell them hope niggas I'm doing it for free anyway. This is Rucker Park. What you mean they complaining? What are they complaining? Nah, but uh, shout out to Easy, man. Um, I hope y'all get past this shit for real. Like, somebody's got to be some kind of voice of reason. I don't need no peace between y'all niggas. Y'all niggas can box when you see each other as far as I care. I really don't. But as a battle rap fan... And this nigga who be going to these shits and I be in it because they used to do this whole notion bloggers is afraid to come outside. Woo -dee -woo -dee. Now I've been outside so much they think I'm homeless. So they and they'll never go back and readjust like, yeah, I said that, but it's not, it, it never happens. So what I'm saying is for the safety of the people who be there, nobody wants to go to an event, have to look over their shoulders, not knowing what the fuck is going to go on, if niggas are going to fight and all of that. Tighten up, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's battle rap. Shit's supposed to be fun, man. It's the end of the year. God damn, 2024, we'll be back for some more. Shout out to my guy SP, you already know what it is, gang.